Hello and welcome to episode 288 of the Daily Sales Message Podcast, where every single day I share a piece of simple and actionable advice that's designed to help you sell more stuff and feel more confident too. That's what we're trying to do here. Today, the relationship episode. Ooh, we're talking about relationships, um, but we're not going to get too deep, of course, because I just, frank, quite frankly, don't have the time. I do these things in about three to five minutes or less, so we've got to be as quick as possible. So we're not talking too deeply about relationships, but what I'm going to tell you is this. Relationships lead to revenue. Relationships lead to revenue. And I want you to remember that. Write it down, print it out, do whatever. Remember that. So many people think they can just steam into your DMs, your direct messages, or send you an email, or you see their advert once online or whatever, and you're going to buy from them. It's so much more complicated than that. There's the 7 uh, theory where people have to see seven pieces of content over 11 hours or whatever the numbers are. Basically, we've got to see a lot of you and have a lot of touch points with you before they buy. And whatever the specific numbers are, and it will change from person to person, the overarching kind of theory and understanding of that is absolutely true. And think about this yourself. How many times have you seen the same advert for the same product and eventually you've bought it and you don't really know what tipped you over the edge in the end, but you had to see it quite a few times. So that in a way is a relationship because you, you've had a relationship with that advertiser because you've seen that advert a few times. Same goes for message cold messages so dms direct messages emails any kind of outreach pitching etc it's very rare if not pretty much impossible to happen upon somebody pitch them and in the first interaction they go oh my god this is exactly what we've been waiting for we're going to buy from you Ta-da! it's a lot more complicated than that so if you focus on relationships focus on the longer term focus on having a solid good relationship with that potential buyer and relationships is a strange word to use if it is an online advert because how can that happen but replace the word relationship with interaction so make sure the interactions that you're having with these people are positive they're plentiful and you're always there ready to offer them what they need should they want it so this isn't about spamming and pushing and pressuring people but it's about having some degree of omnipresence where you're always there you're ready to go and they're going to see your adverts or hear from you on a fairly regular basis and over time the relationship is going to grow and over time that's going to either drive them towards buying from you or drive them away from buying from you but it's the relationships you have with the potential buyers around you that lead to revenue. It's pretty much impossible to cold DM somebody, instantly get a response from them, and they buy straight away. Right, that's it for this episode of the Daily Sales Message. Tomorrow in episode 289, we're going to be talking about something that pretty much solves all problems in sales. This activity pretty much solves all of your problems in sales. And the activity is not just selling more. It's a little bit more deeper than that. But join me tomorrow for that episode where we'll explore that. In the meantime, if you haven't already, hop on over to sellingconfidencescore.com. Sellingconfidencescore.com. There is a two minute, 20 question quiz where you can find out your number one sales blocker, what's holding you back. And more importantly, how to resolve that with a personalized and simple action plan. So sellingconfidencescore.com takes about two minutes to fill it out. That's it for this episode of the Daily Sales Message. I'll catch you tomorrow for another exciting edition.